Hello, everyone. Good evening. Hello, teacher. Good evening. Okay, uh, let's wait one minute for uh, for the people that are logging in. Okay. Let's wait one minute. Okay, hello everyone, good evening. All right, if you can, please turn on your camera. Uh, we have, I'm going to take a screenshot. We have to tomar una captura. If you can please turn on your camera. Okay. Um, uh, Luis, Cecilia, Maria, if you can turn on your camera, please. Okay, so, uh, veo que algunas personas se están incorporando porque todavía dice ahí que se están conectando, me sale un mensaje. Eh, vamos a tomar la captura en, 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 unos, en unos cinco minutos, ¿ok? All right, so, uh, igualmente la asistencia porque veo que algunos se están incorporando. Okay, very good. So, le vamos a dar ahí un par de minutos a ellos para que se conecten. Okay, today is uh, April 8th. Okay. We're going to look at uh, some topics from section two. So, ya, ya ingresamos a la sección dos, ¿verdad? Yo creo que ya todos están ahí. La mayoría ya terminó la sección uno. Vamos a los temas de la sección dos. Okay, I need two people to read the conversation. I need uh, a woman and a man to read the conversation. Volunteers. Uh, Luis and una señorita. Me, teacher. Okay, very good. No sé quién es mí. <laughs> Your name. <laughs> okay, okay. No lo puedo ver a todos ni solo. Okay, very good, Luis. You're going to be Chris and Fabiola, you're going to be Linda. Okay. Guess what? I have a new apartment. That's great. What is it like? It's really beautiful. Is it very big? It, it, well, is it very big? Well, it has a big living room, a small bedroom, a bathroom, and a kitchen. Where is it? On um, Lake Bear Drive. Oh, nice. Does it have a view? Yes, it does. It has a great uh, view of another apartment building. Excellent. Very good. Excellent. Okay, here we are using simple present. Again, I have a new apartment. Simple present. Okay. A WH question. What's it like? Uh, adjective, beautiful. 
big, small. Todos estos son calificativos, right? Adjectives. Okay. Where is it on Lake and Lake View Drive? Esto es una una calle, right? Lake View Drive. Does it have a view? ¿Qué quiere decir eso? Does it have a view? What do you think that it that means? Does it have a view? Si tiene una vista bonita, no sé. Sí, si, si, si tiene una vista, ¿verdad? Le está preguntando si tiene una vista bonita, right? Si tiene una vista atractiva. Yes, it does. It has a great view of another apartment building. Okay. Excellent, excellent, guys. Very good. So, um, ¿ya escucharon esta conversación en la plataforma? Yes. La mayoría. Yes, I do. Okay. All right, very good. So, uh, después de eso hay una lección pequeña de grammar. Uh, questions with do and does, lo cual ya hemos repasado bastante. Veámoslas. Do you live in an apartment? Okay. So, necesito do or does. Subject and then the verb. Do you live? Right? The verb is present tense. Do you live in an apartment? Yes, I do. No, I don't. Okay. Do the bedrooms have windows? Okay. Have is the net, right? So I'm, I'm asking if the bedrooms have windows. Yes, they do. No, they don't. Very good. Does Chris live in a house? ¿Por qué uso does aquí? Does. <laughs> Es tercera persona. Correct. Porque estoy hablando de Chris. Correct. Yes, he does. No, he doesn't. So, en mi respuesta tengo que usar también does or doesn't. Okay. Does the house have a yard? Now, aquí estoy hablando de la casa, pero igual como es una cosa, uso does. Okay. Does the house have a yard? Yes, it does. No, it doesn't. Yes. No, it's Very good, right? So, aquí tendría que tener he, she, and it. It, en el caso de it, es una cosa, una casa, right? Very good. Now, ¿por qué aquí uso does, pero no modifico el verbo have? No pongo lives or has, porque ya tengo el verbo auxiliar, ¿verdad? No auxiliar, no auxiliar, pero. Exacto. Very good, excellent. Okay. All right, guys. Hagamos una pausa pequeñita. Eh, tomemos captura y asistencia. Creo que ya la mayoría se incorporó. Okay, today is the eighth. Okay, let's do attendance now. Ready? Ada Gabriela. Present teacher. Alba Patricia Guardado. Present. Armando Antonio Bolaños. Brandon Eduardo Gomez. Present. Cecilia Beatriz Ramirez. Present. Cynthia Vanessa. Present. Damari Saray. Eh, Gerardo Alberto Alemán. Gerardo Alberto. No. Jacqueline Xiomara. Jacqueline Xiomara Ortiz. Juan Antonio López. Juan Antonio López. Julia Maritza Bautista. Present. Okay. Karen Elizabeth Calderón. Karen Elizabeth. The class. 
Eh, Carla Iris Martínez. Present. Luis Alonso Mendoza. Present. Luis Carlos Guevara. Present. Manuel Murcia. Present. María Gabriela Alvarado. María Inés. Present. Marina de Jesús. Present. Marvin Joseph Salazar. Marvin Joseph. Malesa Arey Guardado. Present. Eh, Milagros Elizabeth Mira. Present teacher. Oscar Giovanni Ortega. Present teacher. Raúl. Okay, thank you. Ya lo marqué, Oscar. Thank you. Raúl Edgardo Sarceño. Present teacher. Okay. Rosa del Carmen Polanco. Rosa del Carmen Polanco. Okay. Eh, Ru, eh, Rubén Alfonso Guevara. Present teacher. Ruby Guardón. Ruby. Silsa Saraí. Tania Fabiola. Present teacher. Sochli Alexandra. Present. Ok, very good. ¿Alguien que no escuchó su nombre? Que no llamé. Yo sí que Armando me estaba incorporando. Ok, Armando. Ok, very good. Um, ¿Hay alguien aquí que tiene de nombre eh, Galaxy Pro? <ríe> que ingresó y no cambió el, el, la, la, la foto de... Eh, perdón, el nombre de perfil. Eh, Revisen su nombre de perfil, porfa. Asegúrense de que está bien. Hay una persona que no, 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 no recuerdo su nombre. Hay mis mi disculpas. Pero hay alguien que aquí estoy viendo que dice Galaxy J2 Pro. El teléfono. Necesito que cambie su nombre de perfil. Okay. All right, very. very. Le, voy a le voy a escribir a esa persona un mensaje. Déjame ver si puedo. Ahí está. Okay. Creo que es milagro. Sí, yo creo que ya. Milagro, usted le cayó un mensaje, ¿verdad? Y dice hello. Ok, sí, le acabo. Sí, sí. Le acabo. Vaya, milagro. Ya lo intento cambiar. Sí, creo que hay una opción ahí donde dice perfil, ¿verdad? Donde. Creo que sale su foto. Si no, pues dígame si no puede, yo se lo cambio. Ok, very good, guys. Excellent. So let's go ahead and continue. All right. So short answers with uh, the simple present, right? ¿Alguien tiene alguna pregunta? ¿Cómo responder preguntas en el simple present? Hmm? Do you or does? Okay. Very good. All right. So now let's talk about a furniture or different items that you would find in your house, okay? Let's go ahead and uh, listen and repeat. So, uh, lo que pueden hacer es uh, apagar su micrófono solo para reducir un poco el sonido y de allí donde están se pueden enfocar en la, en la pronunciación, okay? All right, armchairs, armchairs, table, table. Coffee table, coffee table. Aquí corté una letra, pero sería bookcase, bookcase. Dresser, dresser. Stove, stove. Microwave, microwave. You can say microwave oven, pero ya ahora solamente le decimos microwave. Chairs, chairs. Pictures, pictures. Refrigerator, 
refrigerator, mirror, mirror, clock, clock, lamps, lamps, sofa, sofa, rug, a rug, a bed, bed, desk, desk, television, television. Okay, very good. Questions? Mm -hmm. Curtain. ¿Cómo se dice? Cortinas. Ah, curtains. 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 Mm -hmm. the, the, uh, the, the chair is singular or, or, or plural? Chairs. Chairs. Right? Singular is sin la S. Plural okay. with the S. Okay. Teacher, uh, cookcase vendría siendo como... Librera o algo, algo Yes, así. correct. Bookcase. Thank you. Bookcase. Now, si tenés eh, bookshelves, también, que ya la gente solo pone una, un pedazo de madera, va bookshelves. ¿Cómo le dicen en español? De, de prisa. Repisas. Correct. Uh -huh. so, puedes poner, tener eh, bookshelves o bookcase. Okay, very good. All right, so what we're going to do, let me, let me, let me present, I have a presentation that I need to open. Okay, so what we're going to do, right, one of the activities that we're going to do today is describe rooms in your house. Describe rooms in your house, okay? All right, so. I'm going to use there is or there are to describe items, things that are in my house, okay? There is a TV in my living room. There is a TV in my living room, okay? Now, las partes de las casas y de apartamentos lo vimos en la, en la lección de ayer, ¿se acuerdan? En la guía de ayer había una foto con las partes de la casa. So, si quieren repasar eso, pues pueden abrir la, la, guía, la guía de ayer y ahí está la, la parte de las casas. Pero ahora me quiero enfocar en el vocabulario y gramática que vamos a usar. There is and there are, right? Vieron que algunas cosas eran plural, ¿verdad? Chair or chairs. Lamp, lamps. There is a TV in my living room. Okay. So, aquí voy a usar there is, right? Singular. Right? ¿Por qué? Porque eh, mi, sub, mi objeto es um, singular, TV. There are four chairs and a table in my dining room. There is, there are. Okay. Very good. Questions? I can also use... Wait, ya voy a regresar a esta. I can also use have or has, okay? For example, si me voy a referir lo que yo tengo, I have, I have an electric stove in my kitchen. Esto es lo que yo tengo, ¿verdad? Mi sujeto es I, estoy hablando en primera persona, entonces simplemente uso have. I have an electric stove in my kitchen. My kitchen has, ah, ahora uso has, porque estoy hablando de una cosa, my kitchen. My kitchen has an electric stove. Una vez más, I have an electric stove in my kitchen. Or you can say, my kitchen has an electric stove. Okay. Questions? Okay. Eh, creo que 
no sé si les pasé esta presentación, pero si no, se la voy a poner ahí en, en, en el grupo de WhatsApp. ¿Ok? Esa sí, no, teacher, esa no la pasó. No la pasé, ok. All right, very good. Ya la voy a pasar. Eh, don't worry. Ok, so, go back Perdón, to... Perdón, uh, sorry. Uh -huh. no, no comprendí por, uh, por qué Javi has... Uh -huh. right, eh, porque no, aquí mi sujeto no, es I. Ajá. Yo right. tengo, ya, yeah, yo te... Uh -huh. Yo tengo y, uh -huh. y abajo... Ah, mi cocina tiene. Ok, ya, uh -huh. uh -huh. ya. Yeah, yeah. el, el sujeto, ¿verdad? Ok. okay. Esto es it. Ok. Uh -huh. It, correcto. Ahí podría quitar my kitchen y poner it. Uh -huh. Ok, very good. So, look at uh, this house here. Maybe you can recognize some of these things that we have here. Ok, for example, there is a mouse on the chair. Okay, where's the mouse? Ya lo vieron. <laughs> yes, yes, yes. Ahí está. There are mice on the table. Hmm. Where's the table? Mice. mice is plural. Mice is plural. Sería ratón, pero en plural. <laughs> Mouse is singular. Mice is plural. There are frogs on the table, on the TV. There is a cat on the cupboard. There's a cat on the cupboard. There's a penguin on the stairs. There's a penguin on the stairs. Creo que es there. <laughs> okay. There are rabbits on the floor. Okay, rabbit, another rabbit. This is another rabbit here. There are parrots on the door. Okay. There is a fish on the bookshelf. Okay. Very good. So. Si es singular o plural, ¿verdad? Eso va a determinar si uso there is or there are. Okay. Very good. Now, ahora vamos a usar there is or there are. Or pueden usar have or has. Have or has to describe the furniture that I have there. Okay. All right. Very good. Uh, Alguien se puede poner en mute, por favor. Mute. Oscar. Okay. Right. No está allí. All right. si, si se van a retirar, yo les, les recomiendo si se van a retirar, mejor apagar su cámara. <laughs> okay. All right. Very good. Oscar, eh, si te vas a retirar, apaga la cámara. <laughs> y, y el micrófono. Okay. Very good. So. Have and has, right? Aquí está otra forma de ver el uso del, del verbo have and has, right? He, she, it, has. If you use I, have, you, have, we, have, they, have, okay? But if you, you're talking about something, he, she, or it, has. Okay, very good. Look at this. Uh, no le voy a decir qué es. No sé si pueden ver qué es, qué sería, qué parte de la casa. Kitchen. 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 Yeah. It looks like a kitchen. Okay. What can you tell me? There is, there are. There is a lamp. Mm -hmm. There are four chairs. Mm -hmm. Okay. There are there are four chairs. Chairs. Okay, very good. Now, quisiera que usaran las preposiciones que ustedes yo sé que ya aprendieron en el módulo anterior. Okay. There is a lamp on the table, right? Uh, there are four chairs. Están abajo en la mesa. ¿Cómo puedo decir eso? Abajo. Under. 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 Under
table. Very good, right? So ahora están uniendo todo, ¿verdad? Están uniendo el vocabulario, there is, there are, y están uniendo las preposiciones, right? Ahora ya sí están, ahora sí están hablando inglés, right? Uh, ¿Qué más? What else? There you... is a refrigerator in front of the kitchen. Excellent. The refrigerator in front of the kitchen. There, there, there are a there, there are a tree. Uh, uh, there is a, a tree and and the table. Mm, pero te estás confundiendo con there is there are. There no, is. There is a a, a, a tree. Ah, okay. The, the table. Ah, okay, okay. Pensé que me estabas diciendo tree como tres, el número. No, no. There is a tree on the table, okay? Very good. Okay. Excellent, very good. So this is what you're going to do, right? I have another one. What is this? Living room. Living room. Living room. Living room. Living room. Living room. Okay. What do you see? There, there is, is there a mm -hmm. table uh, behind to the sofa. Mm -hmm. uh, behind sería atrás del sofá. No. Uh, in, front. In, front. in front. In front. Next yeah. to the sofa. Mm -hmm. Puede ser next to también. Puede ser in front. Okay. Sí. Puede, right. eh, esta sería como table. Co Coffee table, mm -hmm. right? Eh, Sería correct. Sería más mejor eh, describirla como coffee table, correct? Okay, okay. Mm -hmm. Okay. Very good, very good, excellent. Uh, what about yeah, the TV? The... TV. There TV. is a TV on the wall. Mm -hmm. Lamp. Come on. Acabamos de repasar todo ese vocabulario. There is the television between the tree and the lamp. Excellent. Very good. Good job. There is a fan in the sky. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Eh, no sky, eh, se dice en inglés, ceiling. The ceiling. Ceiling. Techo. Okay. Mm -hmm. Ceiling. Techo. Mm -hmm. Very good. There is Curtains. television from on the table. Uh, I'm sorry, can you repeat? Uh, uh, there is television from on the table. Mm -hmm. Very good. There is a television in front of the table. Excellent. Curtains. Table. There is. There are. There are. There are curtains. There are curtains. Mm -hmm. Next curtain. to no, sofa. Uh, Behind, uh, behind so far. Mm -hmm. Yeah, puede ser next to behind, right? Very good. Okay. okay, excellent. Let me show you another one. What is this? Bedroom. Bedroom. Bedroom, Bedroom. Bedroom right? Bedroom. Okay. So, okay, you throw what is this? Bathroom. 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 Okay. What is this? Uh, laundry. 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 Laundry room. Laundry room. All right, that's it. Let me go back now to the guide. And I'm going to explain to you the first activity we're going to do. So uh, we're going to describe rooms in our house. Okay? Solo describir lo que está en mi casa, right? Eh, no tienen que tomar fotos, nada. Living room, right? What do I have in my living room, right? For example, um, I have a sofa next to the window, right? Okay, very good. I have a sofa next to the window, okay? So, van a describir diferentes cosas y no... No tienen que escribir, sino que más quiero que se enfoquen en la parte comunicativa del ejercicio, ¿ok? So, no pasen allí escribiendo eh, porque les va a tomar mucho tiempo, no van a poder hablar. Prefiero que hablen, que escriben ahorita en este nivel, ¿verdad? Para que ustedes puedan agarrar la fluidez, ¿ok? So, ahí, por ejemplo, um, 
Now, también puedo describir el color de mi sofá, right? I have a brown sofa. Okay. Uh, maybe a table, right? I have a wood table, coffee table. In my living room. Okay. I have a wood coffee table in my living room, right? Si se atreven ustedes a describir el material o, o el color o agregarle cualquier calificativo, lo pueden hacer también. Okay. All right, very good. So, uh, living room, kitchen, garden or yard, bathroom, dining room, bedroom. Okay. Now, pueden usar there is. Um, también pueden usar it has, right? My kitchen has. Uh, well, bathroom. My bathroom has blue curtains. Tiene cortinas azules. My bathroom has blue curtains. También puedo usar it has blue curtains. Right? Si, si quiero usar el, el pronombre en vez del sujeto completo. Okay? Very good. So we're going to do the speaking activity, right? Enfóquese en la parte comunicativa, no, no, no tanto en escribir, porque al final yo no, yo no lo voy a calificar. Eh, so, traten de hablar lo más que puedan, ¿ok? Let's go to the, let's go to the rooms, breakout rooms. Let's do this activity for 10 minutes, ¿ok? No más de 10 minutos. Hacemos 10 minutos en esta, en esta actividad. Porque tenemos otras cosas que hay que ver. Okay, very good. Uh, groups of three. Three people. Teacher, no me había podido conectar porque me estaba fallando el inter. Ok. Ok, Ruby, eh, te voy a asignar ahorita un grupo. Chimiro. Eh, eh, ajá, Miro. Ajá. Eh, ok, en my kitchen. En my kitchen. Eh, in my kitchen, there is a eh, stop. There is a stop. Un alto. Stop. Oh. ¿Qué, qué, qué, ¿Qué quieres decir ahí? Stop. Eh, eh, cocina, tisho. Ah, stop. 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 I'm sorry. Stop. Okay. All right. Very good. Okay. Um, in my kitchen, there is. A refrigerator. Okay. 
Ok, en my kitchen. En my, no puedo irte, eso es una actividad. En my kitchen, there is a. Um, eh, eh, one table. Ajá, uh -huh, one table. And I don't have, I don't have garden. Ok. I don't have a garden. No. Garden. Garden es como un jardín. Uh -huh. I don't have garden. Ok. okay. All right. Continue. Next. Ok. Ok. En el bathroom. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what do you have? Curtains, uh, ah, maybe okay, okay. pictures, uh -huh. cuadrito, pictures, lamp. Okay, okay, okay. In my in my bathroom, there is a bed. A bed, una cama. Uh -huh. En tu sí, baño. Yeah. <laughs> ah, que ahí ya estaba confundido. Entonces, eh, bed. <laughs> Ah, uh, cuando me dijo un cuadrito ahí por eso me confundí. No, okay, picture, okay, picture. okay, 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 okay. En mi, en bathroom there is a, a paper, paper. Uh, there is a mirror. There okay. is a, a, there is a mirror. There is a paper. <laughs> Only that is okay. All right, very okay. good. Okay. Now, uh, uh, remember to use the the prepositions, right? Uh, for example, ah, there okay. is a there is a a sofa next, next to the window. Okay. 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 Next time, para la próxima, right? I want you to use the prepositions. Okay. okay all right. Who's next? Hi. Maria. Um. Bye. <laughs> In living room, living room, I have a sofa next to the window. Mm -hmm. I have the black TV uh, between the mirror um, of case. A kitchen, my kitchen as. Se puede decir as, verdad? Sí. Has, yes, my kitchen has. Mm -hmm. My kitchen has table and chair, chairs. Also, refrigerator and microwave in my garden. I have flowers and chairs. Um, I have table. Mm, it's in my bedroom. See, you, have, know, bathroom, you, have a, you have a mirror. <laughs> I see a mirror in your bedroom. Un espejo. Right there behind yeah. you. Mm, uh -huh. <laughs> eh, Cortai. <laughs> eh, also, window. Eh, dining room. Dining room. No me acuerdo que era dining room. <laughs> eh, dining, dining room. Dining where you, room. Where you eat pupusas. Este. <laughs> where you eat on the comments. Or you sit down. <laughs> okay, entonces, I have a table and chair, chairs in my bedroom. And I had a bed, bed, cama, ¿verdad? Mm -hmm. bed. bed and mirror, and um, cortai. I had a table. And I had a boot. Okay, very good. Excellent. Armando, ya pasó? No. Okay. Uh, in my house. The dining room. Yes. And the, the I have the table, the bedroom, I have the two bed. I have a Cuando tú vas a nombrar un artículo, una cosa, de C A. I have a wood table. I have a bed. Mm -hmm. I have. Mm -hmm. Okay. I have one bed. Mm -hmm. I have. Uh, two lamps. 
Okay. I have one window. Okay. Quisiera que usara las preposiciones, Raúl. You can say, I have a window next to my bed. ¿Te acordás las preposiciones? Next to, besides, sí. in front of. Sí, sí, sí. Pero que estoy tratando de armar la, la oración. Ah, oh, come on, study, study, you have to study, ya tienes que estar preparado. ¿De acuerdo? La preposición la vimos ayer, no sé si estabas ayer. Sí, 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 aquí las tengo. Okay. Next to, besides, in front of. Okay. Ahora, there the, is. Between. Right, there is or there are. All right, describe. Yeah. Describe your kitchen. Describe your kitchen, Raul. The kitchen, uh, there is a, a one refrigeration uh, next to the window. Okay, very good. Uh, I have the, the tree in front of the, uh, the table. Okay. Uh, okay, that's it. That's it. Let's go to the next one. Go to the next room. All right, ya pasaron todos. Brandon, Adam? Yes. Yes, All teacher. Right. Okay, very good. We're going to go back now. Okay. All right, Raul. So I need you to study the prepositions. Okay, very good. Did you describe your house? Right? Teacher, yo tengo una pregunta. Questions, yes. Para preguntar qué hay en tu sala, digamos, sería correcto, what is, do you have a living room? What do you have in your living room? What, what do you do have? You have in your living room. Uh, ¿Qué have y no has? Porque el sujeto es you. Le estás preguntando a otra persona que sería you. El sujeto que estás usando en esa oración es you. What do you have? Entonces solo usamos has con he, she, or it. Ah, oh, ok. Ok, questions. Dice, ¿Cómo se dice esto? Dispensador de agua o oasis. Eh, agua, a ¿no? water dispenser. Ah, a water dispenser. Ok, ok. Thank you. Okay, very good guys. Let's continue. All right. Very easy practice here. Very easy. Do or does. Okay. Blank, your brother, play the trumpet. Do or does. Do. Do you play the trumpet? No. Nah. Does. Does yeah, estoy hablando de otra persona. Ah, okay. Does your brother play the trumpet? No, he? No, he doesn't. Does, he doesn't. He doesn't. All right. All right, déjame ver. Quiero solo mover algo porque no me sale el, 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 el apostrophe. Okay, what about this one? Uh, bueno, eh, vamos de izquierda a derecha. Izquierda a derecha. All right, what about the next one? Do you, you like, like, do you like, do you like, do you like cycling? 
Yes. Yes, we do. Yes, I do. Yes, we do. All right, very good. Next. Yes, she. Yes, he does. She. Yes, she does. Very good. Next. That's your parents. That's your parents like pizza. Yes, they does. Now, parents is plural. Okay. So do 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 your do your parents like pizza. Yes, they do. Yes, they do. do. Yes, they do. Very good. Blank, your grandma read a lot of books. Books? Does. 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 Yes, she? Does. Blank, they have eggs for breakfast? Do they have? Do they have? No, they don't. No, they don't. Don't. No, they don't. All right, uh, solo. Permíteme, lo voy a subir un poquito. Okay, very good. Blank, your uncle sing in the shower? That's your uncle. Does. Does. Does your uncle sing in the shower? Yes, he? Does. Does. Very good. Do you? Do you, do you understand the exercise? No, I don't. No, I don't. No, I don't. Very good. Blank Peter travel by plan. That's Peter. That's Peter. That's Peter by plan. No, he doesn't. No, he doesn't. He doesn't. Blank, we play together. Do we play? Do, do. do we play? Yes, we do. Yes, we do. We do. Blank your father does, go to bed. Does your father go to bed early? Does, does your father? Does. No, no, he does. does no. no, he doesn't. No, he doesn't. Good. Blank, you brush your teeth every day. Do. Do you do, brush? Do you brush? Yes, I do. Yes, yes I, I do. do. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Blank, you go to school by bus. Do you go? Do you go to school by bus? No, I no, I don't. I do. No, I don't. I don't. No, I don't. Negative. Blank. You live in a farm. Do you do you live in? Do you live in a farm? Okay. Yes, you live in a farm. Yes, we do. Yes, we do. Okay. Very good. Live a vivir. Live is cuando algo está en vivo. Ah, ok. Life y live. 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 En esta, en esta, live. Aquí estamos hablando de vivir. So, la pronunciación correcta sería live. 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 Do live. you live, live in a farm? Do you live? Ok. Mm -hmm. Y life es en, en vivo. vivo. En vivo. Ok. Ok. Very good. Excellent. Right. A little quiz. Um, esto no sé si ustedes ya lo vieron, ¿verdad? En el módulo anterior. Um, hablaron un poquito de adverbs yes, yes. of frequency, right? So, igual, okay. estamos usando el simple present. Um, so, always quiere decir siempre, 100% of the time, okay? Usually no, is about 90% of the time. Normally, often, Sometimes, Sometimes. occasionally, Sometimes. seldom, hardly ever, and never. Okay. So, for example, if I ask you a question, do you eat pupusas for breakfast? Usually. Do you eat pupusas for breakfast? You can say, yes, I usually eat pupusas for breakfast. Pupusas in the, in the morning. Mm -hmm. Right, so you can use it según usted, right? You can change it, you can say, I sometimes, I occasionally, ahí como quieran, right? So es para hablar de frecuencia, right? How often do you do something? 
Now, hay una pregunta, no sé si recuerdan, how often? How often? Quiere decir con qué, con qué frecuencia? Frecuencia. Okay. Very good. So, I want to go here to the, to the next activity. Okay. I want you to interview another person, right? So, yeah, speaking exercise, interview. I want you to ask them this question. What is your occupation? Do you have a, do you take a taxi to work? Do you wake up early? Do you check your emails at work? Do you drink coffee? Do you wear a mask at work? Mask is a mascarilla in English. Okay. Una para protegernos del coronavirus, right? Do you wear a mask at work? Do you wear a uniform to work? Do you supervise other people? Do you use your English at work? Okay. Casi todas son preguntas del trabajo. Si no trabaja, entonces solamente cámbiale de, en vez de trabajo, póngale universidad, right? O colegio, lo que sea. Okay. Now, quisiera que respondiera la persona con adverbs of frequency. Okay. Okay. For example, do you take a taxi to work, right? Si usted nunca, nunca toma un taxi, entonces va a usar never, right? I never take a taxi to work. Never. Okay. Y depende allí que vocabulario quiere usar, okay? Always, usually, normally, often, sometimes, occasionally, seldom, hardly ever, never. All right? Very good. So this is going to be the speaking activity. All right. Uh, let's go to groups. And no tenemos mucho tiempo, chicos, so, porque tengo que hacer la asistencia. Um, so five minutes, okay? Uh, Oscar eh, recibió la invitación para ir al grupo. Ay, ay, sería, por ejemplo, si yo quiero responder, sería, hay algo ahí. Hola. Always. A ver. Sería si sí, hay always. Este, sí, en esa hago. te está preguntando cuál es tu ocupación. ¿Cuál es tu ocupación? Uh -huh. ah, podría ser my occupation is student. O ahí en student. Uh -huh. Soy estudiante. Mm. Si hay la otra, do you say a taxi to work? Creo que ahí sí podemos usar. Mm -hmm. Que ya se contestó. I never, por ejemplo, I never take a taxi to work. O I usually take a taxi. O también podría ser I usually take a bus. Ah. Mm -hmm. Sí. La siguiente. Do you may meet out early? Esa es como te levantas temprano. Uh -huh. uh, I normally. Yo diría. Uh -huh. I normally. I usually. No, early. Uh -huh. Usually. Uh -huh. Oh, usualmente. I usually, usually no, early. Usualmente no me levanto temprano. I usually, uh -huh. I usually wake up at 6 a.m. Uh -huh. Wake up at 6 a.m. Uh -huh. 
Huh? Are you sure? La otra sí no sé. Uh, do you check your email at work? Creo que es si revisas tu email en el trabajo, creo. Uh -huh. Reina, estoy en videollamada. Okay. Eh, questions, guys? Questions? Preguntas? No. No? no, teacher. Okay, let me ask you one question. Okay, Maria, one question. Uh, do you drink coffee at work or school? Maria or Maria? Uh, Yo, okay. Maria, Maria. Always. Okay. Always. I always drink coffee. Always, always. Always. No puedes responder en una sola palabra, sino que tienes que decir complete sentence. Tienes que decir, I always, y después usar el verbo, right? I always drink coffee. Sí. Okay, very good. Okay. Eh, Marina, do you check your emails at work? I, Ma Marina? I never check the emails at work. Okay. Eh, <laughs> Julia, do you take a taxi to work? Always. Julia? Mm, I never take a taxi to work. Okay, perfect. Very good. Ahí está, right? So you have to answer a complete sentence, right? Okay, excellent. Good job. Thank you. All right. Okay, tomorrow we're going to practice that exercise. Ese ejercicio muy importante, right? Para hablar de frecuencia. So we're going to do that exercise. I'm sorry, not tomorrow, Monday when we come back. Okay, we're going to practice that exercise more. All right, so tienen la sección dos para completar. La pueden completar esta semana. Yo voy a poner las, las calificaciones de la sección uno. La voy a poner... El sábado probablemente voy a ingresar esos, esas calificaciones okay, de la sección 1. Ok, eh, attendance. Ada Gabriela. Present teacher. Alba Patricia. Present. Armando Antonio Bolaños. Present teacher. Brandon Eduardo. Present. Cecilia Beatriz. Present. Cynthia Vanessa. Present. Uh, Dam Damari Saraí, Gerardo Alberto, present. Jacqueline Ciomara, Juan Antonio López, Julia Maritza Bautista, present. Karen Elizabeth Calderón, Carla Iris Martínez, present. Luisa, uh, Luis Alonso Mendoza. Present. Luis Carlos Guevara. Present. Manuel Murcia. Present. María Gabriela Alvarado. María Gabriela Alvarado. María Ines. Present. Marina de Jesús. Present. Marvin Joseph Salazar. Melissa Guardado. Melissa Guardado. Milagro Elizabeth Mira. Present teacher. Oscar Giovanni Ortega. Present teacher. Okay. Raúl Edgardo Cersaño. Cersaño. Raúl. 
Rosa del Carmen Polanco. Eh, Rubén Alfonso Guevara. Present. Ruby Huartón. Present. Silsa Saraí. Silsa Saraí. Tania Fabiola. Present teacher. Toshley Alexandra. Present. Ok. ¿Alguien que no llame? Melissa, ya está, teacher. Present teacher. No sé qué le pasó a la computadora. No podía hablar. ¿Quién? Melissa. Okay. Melissa, sí. Ok. Thank ok. You. Very good, guys. Uh, tienen, tienen la plataforma ahí para trabajar ustedes. Tienen las guías por si quieren hacer algo extra. Eh, me gustaría que completaran la sección 1 y 2, ¿verdad? Si pueden. Ok, nos vemos Monday. See you Monday. See you Monday. There is a question. There is a question. Oscar, dime por favor, que tengo otra clase, por eh, favor. De, dime. There is, a, there is a, a class tomorrow. No, no, no class tomorrow. No, eh, eh, horario normal. Okay, de lunes a jueves. Teacher. Okay. Yes, yes. Okay, Raúl Sarceño, presente. Okay, all right, Raúl, thank you.